Hi, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to do backwards crossovers. We're here, backwards crossovers. How exciting is that? So the first thing we need to do is the pumps on the circle. Okay, so just like we did when we're going forward, we're gonna go through the same steps, okay? So the first thing we'll do, we'll get onto the circle. We turn our body, the left is facing the circle. The, the head is looking down the left arm and we start doing the pumps with the right foot, almost like a half lemon. Making sure when you look down, your left foot is on an outside edge. So we're just pushing around. And you can even push and hold for a second. Make sure you're on that outside edge and continue, push, push. And when you feel comfortable with this, then we're going to bring the right leg through and then lift the left leg. And what happens guys, is so the right leg doesn't, we do not, do not, ugh. <laughs> we do not pick the right leg up, it doesn't do this. It just comes like this, it never, it never gets picked up off the ground, it actually stays there. The left one steps inside. The further you step inside, the more power you can have. When you just do little tiny ones like this, it's hard to create the power and you will not go on as tight of a circle as well. Now, when you step, when you, when you come across into this position, the left leg is folding sideways. It's folding sideways like this. So it kind of folds over and that's what enables you to be able to come, keep going into the crossover. Step, cross, step, cross, step, cross, step, cross. Okay, and uh, yeah, let's go the other way. Okay, and just before we go the other way, making sure if you are finding it a little difficult to do it without, without uh, lifting, then you can pick that foot up a little bit to get across at the beginning. You can pick it up a little bit, try to get it over, but knowing that the goal is to do like this. Because it's almost harder when you pick it up, a little bit harder, because then you've got to balance on that one foot going backwards, as opposed to stay on two feet here, and then just on the inside edge, you go onto one foot, which is a little bit easier. Just making sure we have nice, soft knees. If we stand up too straight, it's very hard. So get down in your knees, into position here. Okay, let's go the other way. Okay, so I'll face this way. So I'm on the circle and then we face our right side, inside, and now we're gonna start pushing. Our head is looking down the right arm and making sure that foot is staying on the outside edge. And then we can just push and hold and then push and these first steps, really practice these until you're ready for crossovers. If, you, if you're not comfortable in these positions, then don't try the crossovers just yet. And if you are comfortable in this position, then you can try to bring the foot across. And you may trip up a little bit, you may find it a bit awkward, so bend your knees, get down in your knees. And if you do need to step over a little bit like this, then that might be easier for you but I personally feel like that's a little bit more tricky. So just stay here and take your time, go around like this, and eventually you will feel comfortable. And what you may find when you're practicing crossovers and moves on the circle, that your arms get a bit tired. So shake them out a little bit, take a break, and then get back into it, okay? Let's go, let's go one more time. I'm making sure that we are facing kind of where we're going inside the circle here. So we're not facing backwards here, trying to do crossovers, because there could be someone there and you crash into them. We always want to be looking exactly where we want to go. So we've got to twist our shoulders around to face the circle here. Okay, it's not really the arms that are doing it, it's all about the shoulders. Where, where's the shoulders? The shoulders need to be in, facing this way. And you can practice even just stepping on one foot here. And eventually, you'll be able to do the crossover and the foot will be pointed underneath here. Just lose my balance a little bit, push, and the foot kind of comes underneath here. Just like when we do the forward crossover and we end up in this position here, in this position here, we're aiming for the same going backwards, okay? And uh, yeah, as always, message me if you've got any questions or write them underneath if you've got any questions or you need a little bit more clarification on anything 
And yeah, I'll see you in the next video. Bye-bye.